Hi, my name is Chad Nelson, and I'm a Dynamics 365 Customer Engagement Solution Specialist with Western Computer. In this video, we're going to review how to add a case to a queue. So we'll begin by logging into the service module and going to the case entity. We're here on the active case view. You can actually apply and associate a case with a queue directly from here by applying the routing rules that are associated to the case or you can also manually add it to the case as well. So if you have multiple cases that you need to add to a queue, the best place to do that would be within that view. If it's just a single, we'll open up the case here and you can see on the ribbon that we have the ability to add a queue. So you'll see that we have the three queues, high priority, low priority, normal priority. So we can manually assign these to those queues or we can use the routing rules that are in place. So we'll see here that this AC unit is blowing hot air. I'll just, and not working, just to make sure that can distinguish that. So we'll hit save and route. So this will be now routed based upon the routing rules that we have in place, which is based on the priority. So now if we go to the queue, go to queues, go to normal, See that that case has now been added to that normal priority queue. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Stay alert of all the latest video releases surrounding Microsoft Dynamics 365 customer engagement.